So, um, when my mom had to move out of her house, there was one piece of furniture that I wanted to get, and that was a piece that uh, Brian had made for my mom years and years ago. And um, this is it. That is a chair I knew I had just a place for. It. Every time I sit in it, I think of Brian. Hey, here was my brother Don now. <laughs> Coming up the dirt road, the gravel road. Can, can you point out the locust flowers we're going to eat on the trees for dinner? Yep. Nice. I'm going to go down and pick them with a the bowl. Put them on top of the salad. <coughs> All right. Continuing. Okay. Very good of you. Artist Tina Randolph made these. Beautiful. Yes. Artist Rachel Maxey. Okay. My brother Tim used to be in the North Coast native uh, artwork business and he gave me this as a gift. This is the first piece of artwork that went up in the house. Here. Yep. Coming right this way. Okay. Gallop and Gertie. This is artist Nikki Keenan painted this for me. The Comaneros. Yeah, the Comaneros, right. Cool. Mighty Rolling Blackouts. 17 years at St. Clouds and artist Willow Bader painted this. Cool. Got it. And saw blade. Okay, got it. Okay. Right this way. <laughs> Not that fascinating, but this was, uh, you know, I work on a boat. Uh, we circumnavigated um, Vancouver Island two summers ago. West side of Vancouver Island, these are all the stops that we made. I've had a beer can collection since I was 12 years old. I used to um, go out in the woods where teenagers would party, and I would oh. pull these beer cans out of the woods. And then uh, over the years, I've just kind of held on to the good ones, but they'll never make them like that again. Go up high. Oh, yeah, right. Oh, yeah. That's what they call a cone top. I can see it there. It's going to stay where it is. Okay. All right. Keep it going. Okay. The listeners are getting bored. Right. Sure. Yeah. Collection. A barbed wire. Barbed wire. Type. Ooh, Tom. You found that in the garage sale. Uh, I did. Okay. Get There's through. A one bedroom. Two bedroom. Two. What's that transom? Oh, I like there? that tree up there. Well, too. here, this is kind of That is kind of cool. Uh, guy in Tacoma makes these, puts the parts together, and this is a functioning lamp. Oh. It's a like gizmo. Right. Tom. That look nice? Yes. Right. All right. I Move like on. it. Okay. Okay. Kids room over here, where my 89-year-old father will be staying tonight <laughs> on the lower bunk. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna go outside. Yeah. Well, no, we're gonna flip. We're yeah. gonna look at the chair. Not the chair on the front end. The bed. Oh yeah, sure, sure. And the coolers. Oh. I'm madly in love with one person on this planet. Yeah. <laughs> I have it. And uh, fiance. Yeah, we're going to get married in September. Yeah. Hey, this is Heather Mercier. <laughs> What's in your hand? Uh, <laughs> and you're going back east to get married we're in get what married state? In Newburyport, Massachusetts. Okay, yeah. Yeah. What's, the, what, what's going on? This yeah. is a video um, I'm going to put on our YouTube channel. Sh show, oh. the, um, show the bench. Oh, the bench. It's it's covered, covered with That's stuff. a live edge piece of pine. And uh, this is all salvaged uh, paneling that came from my brother Don's place here on Heron Island. I took all the scraps and put it together to uh, put this backdrop. I like it. I have a collection of old things, um, picnic style. But this is my favorite piece here. Before I was born in 1966, my mother um, bought this ice cream maker in Bellevue. It's made in Wisconsin, but she bought it in Bellevue. Um, that's before I was born. Wow. Okay. And this, this is okay. all ceramic. That's a ceramic cooler? Inside. Oh, we'll get a close-up of that. All right. 
Super he cool. Said, you see this uh, piece of artwork? This is also Rachel Maxey. Oh, I like that. And uh, I think Amy Bennett will recognize this. This was in our house growing up. Really? Yeah. Well, let's hey, look who's here now. It's Mr. Green Jeans. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get to that photo poll before we run out of battery. Yeah, come on. Here right. we go. Okay. Hi, John. Hey, look it out. My Next brother Don right here. How do you like yeah. that? <laughs> what great timing. And the fire pit. Oh, yeah. Wow. We wow. love the fire pit. Brian made, uh, I had a need a number of years ago for some benches for a for a bonfire. And Brian right. made these three benches out of black black locusts. Right. Super Under cool. Roberts, this That's right. And there was another time when I told him, hey, I gotta cook a bunch of chili in the woods for a bunch of people. It's just we gotta go civil war on their ass. Yeah. And we came up with this um, this is a tripod. I'm gonna get it from the fire. single. And it goes like this. I remember when Brian did that. Right. Tom had the pot. That's how it works. Super cool. Okay. Hey, good. Okay. That's brother number four. There's five boys. Okay. If they're too hot. Well. Yeah. Let's go take a look at what Matt's got going on the grill. Yeah. Definitely. Oh. Oh, yeah. We love oysters. We love oysters. So yep. these are fresh off the beach, but I expected them to uh, open up, which they haven't. Oh, yeah, so they we'll have. just need to help them a little see bit. That? Yeah. Well, only those two. Oh, see, yeah, they're, they're opening up now. See that one right now? That means they're done right now. Okay. Nice work. When they open, they can kind of explode. I heard so it. Keeping a guard yeah, on my eye. Yeah, you need eye protection. You're right. <laughs> Safety first. <laughs> it's safety third on how on hair now. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh, that smells wonderful. Hey, there's a totem pole. There is a green heat to and, it. And how do you people get around on Heron Island after you had too much to drink? Oh yeah, Does we're that moving. Have something to do with the golf carts? Uh, you never have too much to drink. <laughs> You sure did. <laughs> this is Annie. Annie's uh, golf cart from Palm Springs. <laughs> what year do you think that is? I think Toto. Sinatra was okay. Was probably so cute. So. And then here, lastly, yes. this is a uh, gift from uh, a bachelor friend of mine who's, whose girlfriend was moving in and said, like hell, that's going to be in the living room, and he gifted it to me. Yes. Yeah. So uh, this is the perfect place for it out here on Heron Island, facing the water. Yes, yes. And tell the story of Burke Museum. Right. So he thought that he had a <laughs> he thought that he had a native um, treasure treasure on his hand. He wrote at the University of Washington with a photograph artifact. He said, "What are my responsibilities as an owner <laughs> of this totem pole?" And they wrote him back to say, "Just have fun with it." <laughs> Somebody I'm having fun. We're all having okay. fun. All right, hey, glad you could be out here on Heron Island. How about the, the sauna? How about the sauna? Oh. Ryan has a vivid imagination. <laughs> Someday he'd like to have a sauna here. <laughs> I have a couple other ideas, and one of them is just to put a uh, trailer underneath that roof. Oh. You might be able to get more use out of it for places. Because basically, if I had a sauna out here, all it would be... I know you have uh, images of having all these women coming out and have being extracted from their clothing to go in the <laughs> It's not like that. Out here, we basically all the construction guys that get off work at 3.30 would come and drink beer in my sauna. And right. Right. Okay, right. Oysters are done. Let's all right. Them. Thank you for tuning in.